Welcome to Willow's World of DIY. I'm Willow, and today I'm going to show you guys how to clean out a drain line with this Bauer handheld drain cleaner. Let's get to it. Alright, so the problem I'm having is when my washing machine drains, the water obviously comes up through the floor drain. So you can tell that the line is not draining properly. I start off by running the machine down the washing machine drain line. Um, I couldn't get it to go down into the main line off of this line because my setup has a uh, T fitting and I keep going across the T instead of going down. So I end up having to pull it out of here and they had a CT adapter on the two inch main line coming down. So I took that apart to gain access to the two inch drain line. As you can see, it got a, quite a bit of stuff out of the 2 inch drain line. So we're just going to go ahead and, and pull all this stuff off and clean up the cable and then we'll run it back down the line again. When I'm reeling the cable back in, I use a rag to clean the cable while the while it's being reeled back in. You want to run the cable down the line, you know, a few times just to make sure that you get everything out of there. Once you notice that there's not much coming up on the on the cable afterwards, then I I I flush out the line. Um, I just get a large cup of water and you know pour some down as the as as I'm running the machine. And this just cleans out the line and flushes it out, makes sure all the debris either goes down the line or, or gets in the cable. So as you can see, the cable comes up real nice and clean. Flushing the line out like that also cleans your cable off before you store your machine. So that's a good thing as well. Now I'm just putting the 2-inch pipe back together with the CT coupling that was already on it. And you just want to make sure that these screws are nice and tight so that you don't have any leaks. Okay, I'm just going to show you guys how to operate this machine properly. This has a, a chuck lock for the cable. You just twist it clockwise, it's unlocked. Counterclockwise is locked. Um, I leave it in the unlocked position. You want to leave it in the unlocked position whenever you're casting or retracting the cable. Um, if you hit a clog, that's when you want to put this in neutral and then hit that in lock and, and then go ahead and hit it. Um, you always want to run it in forward, even when you're even when you're uh, reeling it back in. You want to run the machine in forward. Um, the only time you use reverse is if it's the uh, uh, biting on a clog or something and the cable's getting too twisted up. So that's just to relieve tension on the cable, really. So put the machine in forward, push this handle forward. And the machine starts casting out. Push the handle in reverse. And it reels it back in. So make sure your that wasn't casting well because my chuck was locked. Make sure your chuck is unlocked. If you have it in 
neutral, you can obviously, you know, pull the cable freely. Alright, so my thoughts on this, I think this is a great handheld drain cleaner for, you know, I, I think I spent $109. I got it on sale. I think regular price, the $119 from Harbor Freight. And, uh, you know, if you own a house and you like doing things yourself, cleaning out drains is a part of it. So, um, I recommend getting one of these. I think it's a great tool to have around the house. I hope you found this video helpful. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching Willow's World of DIY. Until next time.